And we know the former First Lady's body will be taken to the Carter Center tomorrow afternoon where several events will take place. We are expecting thousands of people to pass by the body as she lies in repose at the center. She and her husband, former President Jimmy Carter, built and loved. Our team coverage picks up with Fox 5's Joy Dukes. Joy, many people want to know the timeline for tomorrow and this week and really what they should know if they want to go and pay their final respects to her. Uh, yeah, Eric, today marks the start of a difficult week for many as loved ones of former First Lady Rosalind Carter prepare to lay her to rest. Uh, we're told that uh, memorial observances for Mrs. Carter will begin in South Georgia and Atlanta, uh, starting with a motorcade. The Carter family will be traveling in from downtown Plains to Phoebe Sumter Medical Center in Americus, where former members of Mrs. Carter's Secret Service detail will serve as honorary pallbearers during a short ceremony there on Monday. Now, the motorcade will then travel to Georgia Southwestern State University in Americus, where the university president, Neil Weaver, and Jennifer Olson, the CEO of the Rosalind Carter Institute of Caregivers, will take part in a wreath laying ceremony. And we're told this event is open to the public. From there, the motorcade will head to Atlanta, where a private arrival ceremony will take place here at the Jimmy Carter Presidential Library and Museum. There will be a short service for library museum and Carter Center staff. That event is private, but we're told the public is invited to watch the motorcade all, all along its route uh, from the start to the finish and pay their respects as Mrs. Carter uh, lays in repos in the library museum from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. tomorrow on Monday. Now, buses will shuttle mourners from St. Luke's Episcopal Church to the repos and back. We're told no bags, purses, weapons, or animals aside from service animals are allowed. And those events continue Tuesday with a memorial service at Glen Memorial United Methodist Church before the motorcade heads back to South Georgia. Georgia from Atlanta and then of course on Wednesday the final memorial service for Mrs. Carter's family and invited guests will take place at the Maranatha Baptist Church in Plain Plains. Uh, now the service Tuesday and Wednesday are not open to the public but of course you can uh, watch those services and uh, stream them online and you can also find more information at RosalindCarterTribute.org. You can also head to our website for details about the routes and where you can watch the motorcade uh, make its way around. That's the latest here live at the Carter Center. Joy Dukes, Fox 5 News. Yes, yeah, important to realize a lot of roads will be closed both in Americas and Plains and of course in downtown Atlanta as that body is taken to the Carter Center. Joy Dukes, thanks so much.